Somebody asked me yesterday, I was talking to some leaders, and one of them said, how about the Bible says, this kind does not go out but by prayer and fasting. I said, this kind of what? <laughs> when they asked him, why could we not cast this demon out? If Jesus had said, because the demon is powerful, and this kind does not go out but by prayer and fasting, we will know that it's the demon that is that strong. But he said, it is because of your unbelief. And this kind. Ah, welcome to church. Those are biblical permutations. Because then, you will be inconsistent in your biblical hermeneutics if you were to think that your fasting will send out certain demons. And yet the Bible says, at the name of Jesus, every knee. The demon that can withstand the name of Jesus has not been created yet. They overcame me by the word of the Lamb, by the blood of the Lamb, and by the word of their testimony. If the word and blood the name cannot overcome a demon, what is your fasting? So you will see that all of those fasting, why is they help you to come into alignment? Because when you, you see, if you are very garrulous, you talk, to them, baby, 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 just go three days without food, take only water, you will be quiet. And if you want to fast, if you've not tried it before, I challenge you, find time, just do seven days fasting without food. Take only water. On the fourth day, by the time you get to the fifth, the sixth day, water is sweet. On the seventh day, you can no longer doubt what comes out of your mouth. You fasted away that faculty and position it and it's so aligned with heaven. That is why even people in the, the morning for they, they ask to keep themselves disciplined enough to be focused on the forces they are trying to seek. Hey, folks.